Hi, I'm going, I just posted a video, oh sorry, my name is Sophie, and I just posted a video called Cups Remix. Um, you can check it out. And I'm a terrible singer, but it was just this really cool idea that I had, and there's nobody really there to sing it. So I thought, why not myself, you know? But um, I know I'm a terrible singer, okay? I'm not being one of those people that I just think thinks it's just so amazing and things I want to show it off. But, um, I am going to teach you how to do the cup song. There are a lot of ways, like there's one where you go like, like I mean, I am where it goes like, and, um, you know, you have the original. I'm just going to teach you how to do the original. Okay. So, yeah. So here's the cup, and um, the first thing that you want to do here is um, you clap twice. So then after that, and make sure the cup is facing down, so then the bottom part, the flat part, is facing up. And what you do is you clap clap, and then you clap three times. One, two, three. But um, for the second and third, they're kind of together. It's like like instead of you go. Like, so like, so after, so this, if you're having trouble in the whole thing, because I did when I first learned, just practice it out a little bit, you know, like five times, you know, pause the video and practice it. And um, so then we go like, and so after that, you're just going to grab it and move it to the side. So, so far, it's like, Oh yeah, sorry, I forgot. So it's then you clap, and then you, and then you move it to the side. So and if you notice, it's starting to sound like part of the cup song because it is. And I, and this is one of those things which can be really annoying during the process. And like you're in practice and you're not going to get it every time. It's really annoying. But when you get it, you got it. You know, it's going to be very hard to forget what to do after that. And so, and then we, we do another clap, so, and, um, this is, this is probably the most confusing parts, like, this and farther on, and um, a lot of people, like, when people go like this, it just looks weird, and so yeah, I ended up with that now, I have to, but, so, like, I'm left-handed, but I'm using my right hand for some reason. But um, with the hand that you want to use, grab it like this. And it's going to be a little bit uncomfortable. Like, go like this, then just twist, and grab. But it's going to be a little bit uncomfortable, but you're going to have a good reason for it to be like that. So it's... Sorry, can't really see that. So. So after we do this, you hold it up, and then um, the other hand is going to get the like open space where you put the chicken. So, so so far it's like okay. So as soon as you are done going like this, put it down like this. Well, I'm talking like your child, just put it out. And so, so far it's... And this is probably one of the most confusing parts. Like, when I first learned, I, from a, another YouTube tutorial, he did teach you how to do this, but I had no idea, so, so I skipped it. Then my friend, Laney, taught me. But anyway, so what you're going to do is, I might want to... Look, you can't see the cups, so that's what I'm doing so far away. And so, after you get this, you go like that. But then, this is the most uncomfortable. I'm left handed, so I'm going to hold it with my left hand, but if you're right handed, you might use your right hand, or if you're, you know, just whatever hand is available, really. You go like this again. Then you have to grab it, and you have to grab it, like, under. So it's kind of like, whoop. 
So like, <coughs> it's uncomfortable, but it's very fast. So for and then this, this is the hardest part. So just practice from this. So I had to a lot. So. And then some people go like this, some people go like that. For the last part, I go like this. And there's really no difference. It sounds the same. I, this is much cooler. That's the only difference. I don't think that it really matters. But if you want to go like this, you can. But, like, because a lot of people go like this, and a lot of people go like that. And some people argue about it, but it's nothing to argue about. Anyway, so then you just bang your hand onto the platform, and you bring it over. So, like... Okay, so that's that. So... And so this is the last part. Then you just bring it up. And you know you notice it's down and then you just do it again. And it sounds really cool. And we're just doing a little sample. Oh, and also the beat. The beat is always hard. Like when you sing, how fast you should go with the cuts. And um, if you want to pause, just get the hang of it, then continue to get the beat if you want to make a cover video. But what you do is so you go like so first of all, you do it with no singing twice, so like... Then you go... Then as soon as you do this, you start singing... So, and then you just start singing the song, so like... And like how fast you go with the cup, but some people go like this, and some people go like this. You're supposed to go perfectly in the middle, so like, like you're like the bee is supposed to go like. So like. So, um, like, on the beat, the tempo, like that. And, um, well, you know, you just gotta get used to the beat, and it's kind of like the middle, but remember, and then, you just keep on singing, you do it over and over again. And here is a simple of the song. And some of these parts I'm stalling, as you can tell right now. And so just get to this part. So I'm just going to start doing this up. I got my sticky for a little while. So I was going to be so big. And I sure like some sweet nothing. And I'm leaving it in my way. When I'm done. When I go up. I just know, so it sounds kind of like you're going to listen about my taco. Anyway, that's the second part. The first part is, you know, you're going to make me about my hair. You're going to everywhere. And, um, well, yeah, thank you. This was a, well, I don't know. But, um, basically, the cut part is from Pitch Perfect. But the song is, from, is sung by Lil and Blanche, she, and they do the cuts thing, but a lot more elaborate and crazy, and like it's gonna be really hard to learn. But um, yeah, and you can just make up your own. 
And my parents were able to go like this, like, then like, you know, I don't know the rest, but still. Um, you know, like some, and a lot of people, like you can do any of trouble with this song to me. My friends thought that Call Me Baby would work like this. It's time to look right. At you, baby, baby, my number two. So call me maybe. So, you know, a lot of things work. And, um, yeah, bye.